Hey guys, welcome to another video and this is a video that you guys have been requesting for the last few days since the time I released the video about the EEA version of MIUI stable for the K20 Pro. Now you've been asking me how do I flash it, I'm getting this error, I've tried from flash tool. No need to worry, in today's video we are going to cover it all. So in today's video I'm going to show you how to move from the Indian stable to the European stable or EEA stable and then from there to come back to the Indian stable. Now mind you, in today's video we're going to look at the TWRP method. So I'll talk about the prerequisites and you know plus and minus things whatever we are going to face. But nonetheless before we get into all of that, if you haven't already please subscribe and hit the notification bell icon so that you get notified every time I upload a video. At the same time, in the description of each video, you will find a link to our Telegram community. You can go ahead and join us there and have a lot of fun. Last but not the least, if you think the hard work is worth the effort, please click on the join button and support the channel. Now, without further ado, hello awesome people. Welcome to Smartphone Tutorials. My name is Kalash. Let's get going. All right, so this is going to be a relatively short video minus the time it takes to flash and you know go to the setup screen and stuff. Looks like the screen is a little too bright for my taste. So if we go to settings over here and then we go to about phone, you will see that it says device name K20 Pro. The software version is 12.0.4 global. So we're going to go from 12.0.4 global over here all the way to 12.0.4 EEA stable. So this right here is the Indian version because as you can see, you don't have the you know bar at the bottom which gives you Android 10 gestures and stuff. So, and even if you have a look at the launcher over here, say we go to settings and then we go to more, go to about, you have the Poco launcher, which is not the case in the EEA or European version. So first thing is the prerequisites, right? So we're gonna need a TWRP recovery, which of course needs an unlocked bootloader. This will wipe everything on your phone's memory. So please make sure you've backed up everything, including your music, photos, and everything else. Now I highly recommend you have more than 50% battery. We right here have 85%. So the first thing that we're gonna do here is flash Orange Fox TWRP. Now, how to do that? There is a video on the channel. You can go ahead and check that out. I'm quickly gonna flash it and I'm gonna be needing one file which is linked in the description, which is of course the European version. So this can work from 12.0.3 or 12.0.4 on the K20 Pro and convert it to a Mi 90 Pro. NFC of course will not work. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna quickly flash TWRP and then we'll see what we need to do next. All right, so as you can see, we have booted into Orange Fox recovery. I will leave a link to this recovery in the description. So, you know, that is what you can go ahead and use. Now, once you are in TWRP, you need to follow a set of instructions. The first thing that I would recommend is format data, which wipes everything on your internal storage. All right, so I'll show you how that is done. But even if you're encrypted or decrypted, unless you're a pro at flashing things, I would recommend you do that to avoid any encryption, decryption, or boot loop related issues. So to do that in Orange Fox, all you have to do is you have to go to menu, then you have to go to manage partitions, select this data partition over here, use the tick mark, type in format data, over here type in YES, yes, and select this. Now I'm not doing it because I've already done it, but the moment you do this, it will show you that it's formatting everything and once it is done, it'll take you to the screen again. So then what you need to do is you need to do go to reboot and select recovery, right? Now, once that is done, you need to go to wipe over here and you need to select Delvic cache system vendor data internal storage and you need to wipe everything, okay? Now, once that is wiped, you need to connect your phone to the computer or laptop and copy this file, which is linked in the description to your phone's internal memory, all right? So I'm gonna wipe everything except the internal storage over here because that's where my file is. So let's go ahead and wipe here. Okay, now we just need to go ahead and flash this. Okay, now as you can see, this says EEA Global. 
so that is the european firmware or rom whatever you want to call it now second thing over here uh, in a normal scenario if you want to keep the twrp recovery you would flash you know dfe or magisk or something of that sort so that on the first boot the system doesn't overwrite the orange fox twrp custom recovery but in this case we are not going to do this because the idea of this video is to show you how you can move from your phone being a k20 pro to a mi 90 pro completely stock although on an unlocked bootloader so we won't flash anything after flashing the rom we will just boot the rom and the moment we reach the setup screen that will mean that you know the phone has booted successfully and you have the stock recovery the only thing that you have is unlocked bootloader which will allow you to make any changes in the future now what that will also mean is you have a clean flash with everything wiped and you will have android 10 gestures you will have you know not the you will not have the poco launcher you will have the system launcher and all the other goodies that i explained in that video but what this particular method will ensure is the moment the european mi 90 pro gets an ot update you will also get it so you can permanently stay on this rom unless you are you know maybe selling the phone or you're giving it to someone else and you want to bring it to complete stock for that we have a different video for now we will go ahead and quickly wait for this to be completely flashed and then we will do the first boot all right now as you can see it's a successful so we're going to do a wipe cache over here and remember we don't need to flash anything just reboot system so that it overwrites your twrp or orange fox twrp with the stock recovery now of course this is a first boot this is a miui based device it'll take a minimum of two to three minutes so please be patient while that happens and once we are on the setup screen i will quickly skip the setup i will get into the system and i'll show you guys that we are on the eu version which will serve the purpose of this video let's wait for it to boot up all right so we are on the home screen right now and as you can see you can already feel the smoothness there is something about the european rom that you know just makes you feel different about the software it says miui global stable the device name changes to mi 90 pro right now from here you can definitely go ahead and check for updates and stuff whenever there is an ota update you will get the ota update you do have all the you know you don't have uh, the poco launcher over here if you go to settings and you go to more you will see that this is the system launcher with the android 10 gestures and stuff and this overall does score higher compared to the stock uh, indian rom so overall it transforms your k20 pro into a mi 90 pro nfc won't work but otherwise the performance increases and uh, it's a worthy gain if you have an unlocked bootloader and you want to stick to stable miui updates i would recommend go ahead and do this and there's always a way back i did mention at the start of the video that i will show you how to go ahead and flash back the procedure is exactly the same the only difference is you need to flash the indian rom instead of the global rom the link for the indian rom of 12.0.4 is also mentioned in the description and if you want to completely lock it out you can follow my guide of uh, reverting back to stock and you can choose lock the device so this was a quick way to transform your k20 pro into a mi 90 pro and get better software experience let me know in the comment section how did you find this video and if you're new here please subscribe until the next one, this is Kailash signing off at Smartphone Tutorials. Keep smiling. Take care. Goodbye.